Celtics, Bucks, Game 5. From the Garden, TV Garden, there is Marcus Smart, playing for the first time since March 11th, back from that right thumb injury. Be careful, giving him five. Enters the game with four minutes left in the first quarter, making an immediate impact, diving to the floor, playing defense, breaking up the alley-oop, drawing the offensive foul against Chris Middleton off the inbounds, the layup. Five points, two assists, two blocks, one steal at the half. Boston up. Things get physical. Terry Rozier and Eric Bledsoe pushing and shoving. And then uh, Bledsoe pushes Rozier out of bounds. Bledsoe called for a flagrant one. Rozier called for a technical foul. I think they both know each other's names now at this point. Third quarter. Rozier responds. Catch and shoot. 16 points in the game as he drills the three. Boston up by 16. But the Bucks get back into it. Chris Middleton. Pump fake. Got him. 23 points in the game and one. Shabazz Muhammad all alone in the corner. He had 11 points in the third. This Milwaukee a little bit closer. They're down 61-57. Mark Smart, throw it up, throw it up to the big man. Horford. Getting it done. His 10th career 2010 game in the playoffs. More on him in a second. Let's talk about Jabari Parker. Making a lot of things happen after struggling in the first couple of games. It's a layup and one. Parker off the miss. Strong. 17 points in the game. Brings Milwaukee within four. Back to Marcus Smart. Check this acrobatic layup coming at you right now. Nine points, five rebounds, four assists, three blocks in 25 minutes. Celtics fans love that. Boston up 74-68. Fourth quarter. Giannis. With the fader. He has 16 points, 10 rebounds, 9 assists. Just misses the triple-double. Milwaukee inching closer. Celtics get a break late in the game. Shot clock winding down. Al Horford misses the three. Celtics get called. Get their offense rebound. And Thon Maker is called for the foul. Take a look at the replay. You see Horford did not get the shot off in time. And it was a shot clock violation. Should have been called, but it wasn't. Fourth quarter, Celtics up late. Marcus Smart. Gets the inbound, swarmed, but finds a way to get it to Al Horford. Seals the game. Horford, 22 points, 14 rebounds. Like I said earlier, his 10th career playoff 2010 game. Celtics looking good. And that guy right there, Johnny on the spot, comes back in time. They go up in the series 3-2.